Hello and welcome to Celestial Chronicles, the channel where we explore the mysteries of the universe and beyond. In this video, we are going to talk about the Anunnaki, a group of ancient aliens who allegedly created humans as slaves to mine gold for their planet. Who were the Anunnaki and what was their purpose? How did they influence the history and culture of the Sumerians, the first civilization that recorded their existence? And what does the scientific evidence say about their origin and return? Stay tuned and find out. The Sumerians were the oldest civilization in Mesopotamia, the region between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, now part of Iraq and Syria. They emerged around 4000 BC and developed a sophisticated society with advanced knowledge in writing, astronomy, mathematics, and medicine. They also created the first known literature, law codes, and epic poems. One of their most famous works is the Epic of Gilgamesh, which tells the story of a legendary king who searched for immortality. But how did the Sumerians acquire such remarkable wisdom and skills? According to their own tablets, they were taught by the Anunnaki, the gods who came from the sky. The word Anunnaki means, those who from heaven to earth came, in Sumerian. The Sumerians believed that the Anunnaki were the creators and rulers of the world, and that they descended from a planet called Nibiru, which orbits the sun every 3,600 years. The Anunnaki came to Earth around 450,000 years ago, according to the Sumerian texts. They were looking for gold, a precious metal that they needed to repair their damaged atmosphere. They found gold in Africa, but they soon realized that mining it was hard and tedious work. So they decided to create a new species of workers, using clay and their own DNA. They mixed the genes of the Anunnaki with those of the native hominids, and created the first humans. The humans were obedient and loyal to the Anunnaki, and served them as slaves in the mines and the fields. The Anunnaki also taught them the arts of civilization, such as agriculture, crafts, and language. The humans worshipped the Anunnaki as gods, and built temples and statues in their honor. The Anunnaki also appointed some of their own as kings and priests, to govern and guide the human population. But not everything was peaceful and harmonious between the Anunnaki and the humans. Some of the humans became curious and rebellious, and tried to access the divine knowledge and secrets of the Anunnaki. They wanted to be like the gods, and to have more freedom and power. The Anunnaki were angry and disappointed with the humans, and decided to punish them with a great flood. They planned to wipe out the human race, and start over. However, some of the Anunnaki were sympathetic and compassionate towards the humans, and warned them of the impending doom. They helped them build boats and arcs, and instructed them to save themselves and the animals. The flood came and destroyed most of the civilization, but some of the humans survived and repopulated the earth. The Anunnaki were divided and conflicted, and some of them left the planet, while others stayed and continued to interact with the humans. They also promised to return one day, when Nibiru comes close to Earth again. But is there any truth to this ancient story? Is there any scientific evidence that supports the existence and intervention of the Anunnaki? A group of researchers from Kazakhstan claim that they have found such evidence, and that the Anunnaki were an advanced alien civilization that visited and manipulated the human DNA. They said that the human genome contains traces of alien genes, and that the Anunnaki limited our abilities and potential, to keep us under their control. They also said that the Anunnaki left clues and messages in the ancient monuments and texts, such as the pyramids, the Stonehenge, and the Book of Enoch. They said that these clues reveal the true history and destiny of humanity, and that the Anunnaki will come back when Nibiru approaches Earth again, which could happen in the near future. What do you think of this theory? Do you believe that the Anunnaki are real, and that they created and influenced the human race? Or do you think that this is just a myth, a fantasy, or a hoax? Let us know your thoughts and opinions in the comments below. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Celestial Chronicles, for more videos about the mysteries of the universe and beyond. Thank you for watching, and see you next time.